Everybody, welcome back. So, uh, just doing a quick intro, real quick. Uh, my truck is set up here. It's getting pretty dark out, but tonight's the first night of the Crater Rendezvous for 2022, and I've got my truck all set up. As you can see, I have my curtains in the back. Got two front curtains. There's some on the sides, and then my bedroll. Bedroll. What's that even mean? Bedroll is right there. It's that orange. We also have. The Zender Super Bass Pro once again, and uh, this thing's pretty awesome. We're gonna run a box fan, my light, and an air fryer for some hot pockets. So yeah, this is my second night truck camping in this. I didn't feel like bringing my tent. My tent's pretty bulky in the first place. I didn't feel like setting it up. It's gonna be hot. Last year I brought that tent and it was too hot. So pretty much in a bit here we're gonna go ahead and turn on the Super Bass Pro plug in our air fryer and uh, heat the hot pockets up so we'll see how it works but uh, yeah for now I'm gonna go enjoy by the fire as you can see everyone's by the fire see Gio sitting over there on his phone he's doing a video Gio I hope you're watching this but yeah everyone's by the fire tonight's the first night this isn't the main night this is just the night that you can come early if you kind of want but there's the pond down there we got some trees Everyone's set up down around the outskirts. And I'm in my truck, so we'll see how it is. Hopefully I don't get too hot. But for now I'm gonna go enjoy, and I'll see you guys at the truck later. All right guys, so it was super comfortable last night on this actually. It's the second night I've slept on this thing, but it was really comfortable. But it's the next morning, and I'm gonna film some stuff today at the rendezvous. But uh, I'm staying here again tonight. I have this open so it don't get too hot in here for later. But we got the Zender Super Base Pro again, and we got the air fryer. We're gonna heat up a hot pocket, so it works pretty good. So, but I appreciate them for helping me out with getting this power pack. I've already used it before in a video, but this thing is awesome. I mean, it's got six plugs on the side. We've ran a refrigerator, a TV. Um, I've ran box fans before. I've used this air fryer multiple times with this. You got six normal plugs on the side. I know I don't got professional terms for this stuff, but right here's where you can charge or you could put on the solar power adapter. Plug that in. I didn't bring my solar panel for this because this holds enough power. This is more than I need for two days. Because uh, I'm only going to be running the air fryer and a box fan and lights. So. You have 200 watts, and you have 220 watts on the front, and then 13.6 volt out. I'm not sure what you use that for. Um, I wouldn't use those, but I use these for Type C. All you do is click this. It turns on. It's still at 98%. Give it a second, and then you click AC, and that will kick on the output for anything plugged into the side. So now that this is on, it's real windy by the way right now. I don't know how loud it is, but got my old dirty air fryer. This takes a lot of power, guys. This takes a lot of power. It's like 1,200 watts. So that's pretty top end of uh, electric use. But what we're gonna do is reach in my cooler over here. Oh, it windy. Reach it over here. Grab out my hot pockets. Right here we got. Chicken, bacon, and ranch, crispy, buttery crust. Check that out. So I gotta, I gotta cook these now. Um, there's food here, but I gotta cook these now because if I don't, they're gonna go bad. So all I'm gonna do is take these chicken, bacon, ranch out of the wrappers. And since they're unthawed, they won't take as long as they normally would when I cook them. But I wanna mention, I've already done this before. Like, I've already taken my air fryer in this power pack to places and I heat up like pizza bites or something in the driveway. So these things look pretty good. I don't want to put the paper in here, but I'm just gonna stick these guys in like that. I'm actually gonna stick them on the tin foil. I'll do that off camera, but I'll show you real quick. It's plugged into the power pack, you guys can see that. Ten minutes at 
400. Should only take about eight minutes, seven, eight minutes for these to be really crispy and hot. So we're gonna let them go and I will see you guys when they're done. Right now we're sitting at 97%. It's, it's putting 1200 watts out right now out of the power pack. And it's saying it could run for 2.7 hours at 1200 watts. Okay guys, so I have the fan plugged in here and uh, air fryer is running right now. We're gonna go ahead, kick it on. And just like that, you got a fan. This thing's really good with power. And um, lately when it comes to product reviews, because this was sent in as a product review months back actually, I've used this for a while. Um, I've used this a lot personally, not on the channel for things I've needed, and I haven't had a single problem with this. It charges really fast, and yeah, I mean, I can't give it enough credit. It's a really good power pack. All right, guys, so I put it back in. I had to go real quick. We all went down to the water, so I just shut my tailgate, put these in, and uh, they are cooked and ready to eat. So we're gonna see how they are. Wait, oh, they're, 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 they're not that rare down there. Did you? <laughs> right. You seen Georgia? <laughs> yeah. Camping, yeah, he got one or two. He caught a bunch. Did he get a bunch of black? Yeah, he told me that it's not that rare down there. My girlfriend told me she said in her future home, Morgan said, "Action." Okay, guys. So I already had the, the bear sloppy Joe. I didn't even know it was bear, so I can't try bear for the first time again. It's already good. But there's pulled beaver and elk. And I don't think I've had, I know I haven't had beaver, but not sure I know. So we're going to try this pulled beaver. It's from Boxy. I've seen the beaver he got. Yeah. I figured that's easier. Yeah. In case there's like a little bit of 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 a I know, I know. I mean, it's not bad. Well, that, it's not like, that's me boxing here, so. It's not like yeah. you, none of this was gross, okay? I just want to try it on camera, so. There, I've ate beaver, guys, and I'll have the rest of that. Yeah, I think we're good. So, uh, let's uh, go ahead and start giving some of these uh, kids' prizes away. We have asked all the kids to uh, run. Outdoors, got the one and a half from uh, Blakely's Trap and Supply. And uh, the number two Duke Dollars from Trapper J. And we got some, uh, this one here has Trapper J Coon Candy. Uh oh. And the winner is. For a kid? For a kid. Somebody's gonna learn to trap. Ben! Ben is gonna trap! <laughs> ben? Ben, sit here. You ben, you won. Ben. Hey, you won a trapping set. We get to learn to... What do you say, Ben? Learn to trap. Ben. Got a couple of traps in there. Someone. Okay, guys, so I know the audio is not the best on here and the camera isn't, but my iMac just doesn't... It, it crashes all the time, so now I'm stuck to my laptop. But, um... Basically, this was the 21st of May is when I filmed this, so it's been a long time. For some reason, I thought I posted this. Like, I literally thought I posted this, but I never posted it. So I'm guessing what happened was I was editing it on my computer that crashes, and it crashed, and I lost it, and I probably just stopped. So that's probably what happened, probably why I forgot to do it. So, But yeah, it was a fun little meetup. I went last year, there's a video of it also from last year, and it was great. So I didn't film a lot this year, because last year I did a lot of the reviews with the channels that were there, and I just kind of enjoyed it this time and hung out, but um, I think it was, was it the last night? I don't know, one of the, like, either the last night, or yeah, it was, okay. So the last night I stayed there, this huge storm come in. So I didn't even film it. I don't know why I didn't, but this huge storm came in and like blew everything over. But I was just in the back of my truck, so it was fine. But um, it was nice seeing everyone there. 
Um, everyone else has had their videos up for a while. So I'm sure they will comment down below and say, you know, what's up. So make sure to go check out their channels. And uh, also, thanks Zender for sponsoring this video. I know it's very late, and I'm sorry Zender, but um, I, I've still used that power pack like for a lot of things. So even since then, and since before. So yeah, um, I appreciate it and them for you know helping out again. And it is an awesome product. So I will leave the link down below and a promo code down below for you guys. But yeah. Um, I really uh, appreciate you guys stopping in. I'm sorry this hasn't been posted since May. It's just been on my computer. I thought I posted it, but I didn't. So, yeah. I appreciate you guys for watching. Like I said, promo code will be down below if you want the Zendor Super Base Pro. And, uh, I mean, if not, just leave a comment and uh, please check out the other channels. They say they were at the rendezvous. So, yeah. I'm sure they're doing the rendezvous next year. So, I hope to see some more creators there next year. Thanks for watching, guys.